right, so first we're just starting out with a base. Um, I'm using a eyeshadow, um, like a cream eyeshadow from Maybelline for that. And then I'm just taking a vanilla color and putting that in the highlight and then taking just like a taupe color as my transition color in the crease. Next, I'm putting this pretty teal color in my inner um, tear duct just for a pop of color and then I'm taking this really pretty matte black on the lid and I'm placing it all over the lid because this is a smoky eye look and we want it to just go all over the lid basically so yeah I'm just taking more on there and just making that color even more pigmented you can use any black that you feel um, you like so yeah taking that up to the crease and don't worry about blending because we're going to use another color to kind of blend that out. Um, so right here we're taking a navy blue and we're going to use that to blend that in um, and blend that harsh line out. And then I'm taking a brown color, just any brown, and I'm using that to kind of transition even more and blend that out even more so that it's not just a harsh line. Then I'm taking that vanilla and I'm putting that right back on the highlight to again blend it out more so that it's a nice blended look. Next, I'm just going in and um, concealing my acne because I'm breaking out pretty good. So yeah, we just want to yeah. conceal that and rub that in, blend that into the skin. So next I'm just taking some foundation and I'm applying that with my Real Techniques brush all over my face. And then with a darker concealer, I'm just taking that and putting that as my contour. Um, using this is going to help my contour stick out a little more um, as, with a cream base rather than just the powder. Next, I'm taking my Beauty Blender and I'm using that to just blend that cream contour out so that it isn't harsh. And then I'm going in with a powder contour and I'm putting that on top of the cream contour. I don't know, I just feel like I like this look more than just a cream or just a powder contour. I think when you put them together, it just helps your contour stick out way more and I love a contour. Next, I'm highlighting. You can use, I'm not naming the name of the products because honestly, you can use anything that um, you have you don't have to use what I'm using but I will put down in the um, description below the products that I use just in case you would like to know then I'm taking my beauty blender and I'm just blending that out um, 
yeah, I normally use my beauty blender really just to blend out my highlight and my contour. So again, just blending that out with the beauty blender. Then I'm just going in with a highlight powder and setting that um, highlight that we just put on. Just blending that all out with a nice, um, just a kind of like a peachy pink blush. I feel like that just helps the two transition so well. All right, guys, that's it for this video. This is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment and like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching.